to drop a like in the next 5 seconds if you need this many V-Bucks on your Fortnite account. Try it out. The season is almost over, and you thought you knew it all. You completed challenges, leveled up your battle pass, and unlocked all the rewards. But let me tell you this, there are actually a ton of hidden rewards that not many people know about. And in this video, I'm gonna show you what they are and how you can get them. And of course, these hidden rewards are all different types of items. We got a free battle pass, a free pickaxe, and a bunch of other crazy items. So make sure to watch the video till the end. But before we dive into it, make sure to subscribe, as 69% of you, my viewers, are not subscribed. So, stop what you're doing and hit that red subscribe button. And if you want to support me, hashtag add. Now with all that out of the way, let's start with the video. Okay, so our first free reward, we've probably one of the easiest. It is a free skin, being the Tart Tycoon outfit, or known as the Apple skin. By now, you probably have all heard about the lawsuit between Apple and Fortnite, where Apple removed the game out of the App Store and banned it for all mobile users. Now, with the release of the new season being only a couple of days away, iOS users won't be able to update their game and play the new season. They will pretty much be left behind in Chapter 2, Season 3. So these are the final days of the entire Fortnite community being able to play together. And to honor this, Fortnite is hosting the hashtag free Fortnite Cup, taking place this Sunday, August the 23rd. To view it, head over to the Compete tab and click on Event Details, giving you everything you need to know. For 4 hours, you can compete within the solo tournament, playing a total of 12 games and trying to earn the most points. Now, there are 3 ways to earn points. For a Victory Royale, you get 10 points. For each elimination, you get 1 point. And for every 1 minute you survive, within these 12 games, you get 1.2. And in order to get the skin, you only need 10 points. So, unlocking the skin is super easy. Just hide for 30 minutes and the skin is yours. And if you end up between the top 20,000 scoring players across all regions, you will receive this hashtag free Fortnite hat that Epic will ship to your home. And for eating the most apples within a single match or across the full cup, you can win some gaming hardware, including PCs, PlayStation 4s, Xbox Ones, Nintendo Switches, and even Samsung phones. Now, if you're wondering where to find apples, here are all the best locations. Make your way over to the orchard. Over here you can find the most apples. From there you can find them at all these houses north of Pleasant Park, as well as at the mountains below the authority, the pond, near holy hedges, or within the fruit baskets. So for those on iOS, make sure to grab this opportunity. But here is what the free Tart Tycoon skin is going to look like. As you can see, he's just wearing a suit and its hat is an apple. It was even teased to us on the official hashtag free Fortnite trailer. Anyways, with Fortnite being banned on mobile, players on console as well as PC can enjoy the Mega Drop event giving us cheaper V-Bucks. Now, next to this discount, we're even given bonus V-Bucks. When starting up your game, it'll give you this unlocking screen, giving you free V-Bucks. As you can see, it reads Epic Games. The Mega Drop is here, with new savings for everyone. We're giving you bonus V-Bucks for recent purchases made between July the 14th, 2020 through August the 13th, 2020. And next to V-Bucks, we were also given the Shooting Star Staff pickaxe, which looks like this. It is all part of the Mega Drop event. Next up, we have an event which will earn you free V-Bucks. Yes, you heard that right. Free V-Bucks. It is another community battle event where you have to play the game and complete challenges. You can earn anywhere from 200 to 2,500 V-Bucks, which is enough to get the Season 4 Battle Pass for completely free, as that will only cost you 950 V-Bucks. And next to the V-Bucks, you also earn the Cop Llama Spray for completely free that looks like this. Now, to participate within this event, head over to community-battles.fortnite.com and after reading all of this, click on the join button. Log in to your account and click on the button that reads allow. From there, start up Fortnite and make sure you enable the feature show on career leaderboards. You can find this under settings, account and privacy and then under gameplay privacy. Just select off to on. Now, when that's done, you can start completing all the challenges. Here are all the challenges you need to complete. As you can see, they're all fairly simple. But remember, in order to unlock the next set of challenges, you first need to complete the previous ones. And after completing all of them, you will gain access to the final challenge. Complete
completing the final challenge will determine your placement and so the amount of V-Bucks that you will get. But don't worry, even if you don't rank among the best, you will still unlock the Cop Llama Spray, which is pretty cool. But hurry, as there's only a couple of days left. From there, this weekend will be your last chance to claim the Hulk Smasher's pickaxe for completely free before it's coming to the item shop. The Hulk Smasher's Pickaxe is a dual wield harvesting tool for Marvel Rarity and reads Hulk Smash. It comes with two selectable styles, them being the default style as well as the Hulk Buster style. And here is what they both look and sound like in your locker. As well as in game. They look super cool and are a must have. Now with all that out of the way, let's hop into a guide on how to unlock them for free, step by step. Okay, so first of all, you want to make sure you have a PlayStation 4 or an Xbox One. From there, have it linked to your Epic Games account. You can check by logging into the official Epic Games website where you can view all your linked accounts. Next up, we need to link a Square Enix account to your Epic Games account as well. For this, head over to membership.square-enix.com slash campaigns slash epic. Once you're on this website, click on join now and sign up by filling in all the details. You just have to fill in your name, a date of birth, an email address, as well as a password. And after that's done, click on join and verify your account. Now after your account has been completed, hit the button to link your account and sign into your Epic Games account. After signing in, press allow and you're done with the linking process. For step number two, we need to download the Marvel Avengers beta. This is a new game releasing worldwide with its beta being playable already. If you play on PlayStation 4, you can download the beta for free within the PlayStation Store. And if you play on Xbox One, you can download it at the Xbox Live Store. Okay. So after downloading the beta and starting it up, it might ask you to confirm your account once more. Anyway, after successfully linking your Square Enix account to your profile, adjust your brightness and let the adventure begin. But before that, this message will pop up saying, complete the Marvel's beta including the 3 harm challenge to unlock a unique reward, which is of course the pickaxe. Now just select play beta and choose your difficulty. Now you want to play through the whole beta campaign mode and complete all of it. Now let me tell you this, it might be a bit time consuming, but it's definitely worth it. Not only will it bring you closer to unlocking the free pickaxe, but it's also quite fun, especially if you're into superheroes. Anyway, after playing through the whole beta, you will be at the shield base and unlock the harm room. The Harm Room is a combat training simulation designed for the Avengers to practice and master their skills and abilities. You pretty much have to defeat all the incoming waves. You will unlock new heroes, abilities and whatnot. And after defeating all the targets and completing all the waves, you will complete the beta as well as the full Harm Challenge, giving you this reward screen. As you can see it reads, congratulations, by completing the three Harm Challenges during our beta, you have earned the Hulk Smasher's pickaxe with bonus Hulkbuster style inside of Fortnite. Log into Fortnite to claim your reward. So head over to Fortnite and claim the pickaxe. When starting up your game, it'll give you this unlocking screen. As you can see, it reads items acquired, giving you the Hulk Smasher's pickaxe. Next up, we have the FNCS Rewards, or better known as the Fortnite Champion Series. It is a tournament where pro players fight against each other for a chance to win a bunch of cash. However, we bots can spectate it and earn some free rewards from it. Just for watching 30 minutes of the FNCS finales on Twitch, we were able to claim a total of 3 rewards. Them being the number 1 back bling, this emoticon right over here, as well as this spray. And here is what it will look like when unlocking these rewards. By the way, if you're a pro and make it to the top, you can win the Axe of Champions, a pickaxe from Epic Rarity that only the world's best players own inside of their locker. Here is what it looks like when unlocking it, as well as what it looks like and sounds like within your locker. As you can see, it reads a Fortnite Champion Series original, and to be honest, it looks pretty damn cool. Talking about rare items, we might finally be able to unlock the Golden Umbrella as next season's Victory Royale Umbrella. I mean, it's been in the files for years, and this still 
still not unlockable. Who knows? And talking about the chapter 2, season 4 battle pass, I'll be gifting it to a bunch of my subscribers when it does come out. So if you want to have a chance on winning it, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel, drop a like on this video and from there, comment down below your Epic Games username. This way, I can add you and maybe gift you the season 4 battle pass. Good luck to everyone who decides to enter. Next up, we have the Derby Dynamo Pack. It got added to the item shop and can be purchased for only 12 bucks. It comes with the Derby Dynamo outfit, the quad roller back bling, as well as the building emote, free wheeling. The skin as well as the back bling have a total of three additional styles. The default style, the minty Dynamo style, as well as the flaming Dynamo style. Here is what it looks like when buying this pack. Oh yeah, and not to forget, it even comes with challenges. They are called the style challenges and require you to complete quick challenges. They can be found right here on the main menu and after completing all of them it will give you a total of 1500 v bucks which makes this pack a must have from there we're getting a shadow strike pack that includes three skins with their matching cosmetics them being the mecha team shadow skin with shadow jet set back bling and shadow combo cleavers pickaxe the Shadow Knight Gunner skin with Knight Back Back Bling, and last but not least, the Shadow Archetype skin with Dark Paradigm Back Bling. Its price and release date are also not sure yet, just like with the Marshmallow Bundle and the Henchman Bundle that still have not been released. Also, the Agent Jonesy skin just got decrypted. You can now get it in your locker and perform emotes with it. Here is what it looks like in the lobby, and here is what it looks like within your locker. It doesn't have an icon yet, meaning it's not ready for its release yet, but soon it will. Now, with the season almost ending, there are few rewards you must claim before it's too late. All the 10 weekly challenges have been released, meaning you can claim all the extra edit styles for each and every single Battle Pass skin. After completing a total of 65 challenges, you will unlock the Golden Stall for the Tier 100 skin. Talking about Eternal Knight, make sure to complete your challenges and level up your account. Not only will you unlock Secret Battle Pass rewards, but you will also complete Eternal Knights and Light Effect. To enable this, you will need to go to the Stall options and select the Super Level, which will give it this new effect for all all its three styles. And this effect is actually reactive to your level. The higher level you get, the crazier the effect gets too. And after reaching level 160, the style is fully complete. So make sure to collect as much XP as you can before the season ends. The same goes for your Bolt Umbrella. As soon as the season ends, you will no longer be able to complete its challenges and unlock its upgrades. So make sure to do this in time. We have this week's secret challenge. It is part of the Coral Buddies quest, where last time we had to give them wood as well as stone, we now have to give them metal. So collect a total of 100 metal and make your way over to coordinate B1, at the top left of the map right above the shark. Over here you will find this launch station. So just interact with it and after doing so, you completed the challenge named Coral Buddies Reach for the Stars, giving you 25,000 XP, as well as the achievement to infinity and beyond. From there, you need to collect the nuclear container. It can be found right up here. So, make your way over to this crashed ship and collect it. And after doing so, you will complete the first part of this challenge. Now, once you're there, hold the button to begin atomic test. Completing the challenge named Coral Buddies Enter the Nuclear Age, as well as giving you another 25,000 XP. And when making your way over to the ship, you will complete a secret challenge, being the Astronaut Challenge, giving you a total of 14,000 XP. It landed all the way south of the map over at coordinate D8. Also, the water balloon item just got disabled. If you own this toy, it is now locked and can no longer be used. Because if you didn't know, it got vaulted due to a glitch. Talking about emotes, we still have all the party emotes. They were found in the files months ago, but still have not been given to us. These emotes are purely meant for use within Party Real itself, to communicate as well as interact with our friends. They're from Uncommon Rarity and so, fairly simple. And who knows, these emotes might even be a part of the Chapter 2 Season 4 Battle Pass. Just like the Ice Hit Spray that we are going to be able to claim for free next season. Anyways, here are the party emotes coming to the game. 